When a toilet becomes damaged or overwhelmingly inefficient, it should be replaced with a new model that provides efficient function and water responsibility. Replacing a toilet can be divided into three main tasks. First, the removal of the old toilet. Second, the removal and replacement of the wax ring, sealing the toilet to the sewer line. With the third task being the installation and setup of the new toilet base and tank. Additionally, consider replacing the water supply valve and toilet tank hose during the installation of the new toilet. Before replacing the toilet, consider the different options and types of toilets that are available. Home improvement and hardware stores generally have a good selection of toilets. However, some specialty shops should be used when a higher end or handicap model is desired. To completely replace a toilet, the following items will need to be purchased. The first item is a toilet bowl or base, which is sold separately from the toilet tank. A toilet bowl comes in two main styles, circular and elliptical. Elliptical being offered to provide a gentleman with more room. The second item is a toilet tank that fits and matches the desired bowl. Tanks usually include all their working parts pre-installed. However, if a tank is sold empty, then a flush valve and fill valve kit, along with a tank lever, will need to be purchased. The third item is the wax ring kit to seal the base of the toilet to the sewer line. The kit should include the mounting bolts for the base of the toilet. The fourth item is the plastic finishing caps, which cover the toilet mounting bolts, giving the toilet a finished look. These caps will always need to be purchased because they are sold separately from any other items. The final purchase should be a cement mixing tub, which will facilitate moving the old toilet out of the house. The tools needed for this replacement are an adjustable open-in wrench or socket wrench, a large flathead screwdriver, a mini hacksaw, a disposable plastic scraper, some plastic trash bags, paper towels, latex gloves, and a utility knife or box cutter. To remove the toilet, begin by turning off the water supply valve and removing the lid to the toilet's tank. Next, flush the toilet to alleviate any water pressure and disconnect the toilet's water supply valve hose from the fill valve's shank. If the water supply valve is corroded in any way, or the valve is more than five years old, then completely replace the valve and hose before reinstalling the new toilet. Now remove the plastic mounting bolt caps from the base of the toilet and unscrew the lock nuts holding the toilet to the floor. If a lock nut has become stripped or corroded, then use a mini hacksaw to cut the bolt. Ensure that any caulk around the base of the toilet is scored with a utility knife. Once both nuts are removed, position the cement mixing tub close to the toilet. Grab the toilet securely while lifting with your legs, slowly place the toilet into the cement mixing tub.